Liberación para everyone. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Giselle. So today's video is another haul. It's more of a fashion haul. It's a little bit of everything, not just clothes. I just had a great experience with Shein, so I got more things from there. And then I also went to ASOS. I think that's how you pronounce it, and I am just so excited to show you guys what I got online. Not only did I go online shopping, but I also went to Target and I got some things. Not too many, just like two, two things. Yeah. I'm gonna stop talking now and I'm gonna show you guys what I got. Hopefully you guys enjoy and let's get to it. Okay guys, my pestaña is falling off. I actually had to clean the bathroom before I even started this portion of the video. So if I look a little different, like if this eyelash is coming off halfway through this video, just know that I was cleaning the bathroom. That's why this is going on. So anyway, so this is the first top that I got from Shein. I just grabbed my boob. Oh my god. So basically, basically this is like a silk top, but it's so like staticky. It's clinging on to my body. It's so pretty though. I love the color. I promise you it's gonna look better when it's not so staticky to my body. I'll probably like run it with like a, a dry sheet. Like a dryer sheet. Is that what it's called? Yeah, I'll probably go with like a dryer sheet so that's not so staticky. <gasps> you can see that box in the background! And the trash can. Oh my god. I don't have a bra on. I have like pasties on because some of the outfits I have call for that. So I just don't want to be switching and stuff. But yeah, I really like this shirt. It's super staticky and uh, silky. Really cute. Liberación for everyone. Okay, okay, okay. Alright, so this next top is so pretty. I love this color. I actually wore this same color in a dress form for a pageant when I gave away my title. I just think it's so flattering. It's such a, like, rich green color. Okay, please don't mind this wet spot. My dog was literally licking his paws and I told my sister to take care of Cappuccino so that he wouldn't wet my shirt and she didn't pay attention to me. Whoa. Whatever, it's already done. So I'm gonna tuck these in as well so that my figure is more um, outlined. So we'd probably wear it like this. It's such a comfy shirt. I think I got this in a large because I didn't wanna be like restricted, but the tela is really stretchy and stuff and I really, really like it. Okay, so this next outfit is so different, but I was so curious to see how it would look like in person. So it's basically like this it's basically like a jumpsuit, jean, top together thing. Let me just show you guys. Got my camera falling to the floor. This is a very awkward angle, but basically this is how it looks like. It comes with this cute belt and it zips up in the back. I really, really like it. I thought I wouldn't, but I wanted to try something different. Okay, I think this is a size large, if I'm not mistaken. I just wanted to have more space in here because, again, I have a long torso. I didn't want to have like a wedgie anywhere. So I got in a large and I really like how it fits. Okay, and this is the last top that I got from Shein. And it's just this white, another puffy shoulder shirt. And I put my hair up so that you guys could see the back. I really like that little detail. Cause it looks really like sophisticated in the front and then BAM! The back has a little bit of back, just a little bit. But I tucked these in also to a pair of jeans. Okay guys, so this top is now from ASOS and I am in love with this color. I actually even bought a shirt this color from Shein. If you guys haven't seen my last haul, that's where I showed the orange top. But this is just such a beautiful color. And it's a bodysuit, so I tucked it into some jeans. And this is in a size 8. Oh, and it's from the brand Misguided. I didn't even realize that. But yeah, I got it in a size 8 because I wanted to make sure that it fit me well. But I love the... Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. But guys, the quality of this shirt is so good. I love it so much. 
definitely recommend you guys to check out Shein and ASOS. Their clothes is amazing. I put a little outfit together because this is the last outfit that I'm wearing some jeans. Because the last item I have is a dress. I never thought I would buy a fanny pack, but this one is just so cute. It's so chic. It's a snake print fanny pack. I got it from Target. Target always has cute things, duh. But I actually wore this to school one time and I took off the belt and I just wore it like with, as a belt. And then I want to show you some, some shoes that I bought. So these shoes are, that's my bed by the way. So these shoes are like trending now. I really like them. They're snake print as well and they're super comfy and squishy and they match the belt and the fanny pack perfectly. I've been really liking snake skin recently. Of course, it's not real snake skin because that would be really expensive, so. And the shoes are from a local store here in my town. It's called Shoe Station. So if you guys have a place like that in your town, check them out. They have really cute shoes like mine. So I lied. This is the last outfit that has jeans involved. So I'm actually bamboozling all you because this is actually a bathing suit. But I'm not going to show, you know, my whole body because I'm not comfortable with that yet. So I'm just wearing jeans with it. Um... But I just really wanted to show you guys the back. I love the bathing suit. I saw it on YouTuber's channel. I will put her name on the screen because I can't think of it right now. And I hate that I can't remember her name because I love her. Like, she is so chic. I love her style, the way she applies makeup. That's like the whole reason why I even went on ASOS was because of her. Wait, hold up. I have to let my dogs out. <laughs> so yeah, I got this because of her and it looks so good on guys. I got it in a size 8 and honestly it hugs me in the right places. It looks so good on. I feel confident in it. I don't feel like weird. I don't feel like anything's gonna pop out. Even though it is a quite revealing outfit. Um... But, you know. Yeah, this will definitely give me some weird tan lines for sure. Uh, and then lastly, before we get on to the most expensive item I've ever spent on online, I'm going to show you little things that I bought from ASOS. So, let me just talk about their packaging first of all. The quality is, you know, you're paying for quality and... I appreciate that in a brand. So this is how my jewelry came packaged. I already opened them, so that's why they don't have like the plastic or they had a bubble wrapping on this, which is so sweet of them. It really shows that they care about the customer and stuff. So I got these really cute antique looking hoops. I'm gonna put them on because I think they just make an outfit. Like, right? They're so cute. And they're not really that heavy. They're a little, like, a little heavy for little earrings. But, guys, that means that they're good quality. I'm so excited to wear these with, like, chic outfits. Ugh. Bro, is this eyelash on? But, like, isn't this so cute? Oh, my gosh. This one is a little chain my mom got me. I don't know where it's from. But I bought one just like it from Forever 21, if you guys are wondering where this one is from. Okay, and then last accessory I got from ASOS is this headscarf that my mom just told me I wasn't going to wear. But I'll prove her wrong. Okay, so I saw Chiquis Rivera wear one like this actually, and she wore it like this. This kind of reminds me of the Cheetah Girls. <laughs> when um, Chanel, that's her name right? Chanel wore it like this, and she was like singing and stuff. like. Um, yeah, this is really cute. I'm not going to wear it like this probably. <laughs> A lot of girls at my school wear these, like this. Why is my mom yelling? She obviously knows I'm recording a video. You could wear them like this. I really don't know what I just did, so you get the point. It just adds oomph to your hairstyle, and you could have like the messiest bun ever, and pop one on, and you look. So this next and last item was an arm and a leg. For me, at least, because I don't ever spend this much money on a dress. I got this dress in a size 6 because I wanted it to fit me a little bit tighter. Because I personally don't like dresses to look too baggy on me. And this style of a dress is already kind of like a little bit more on the slouchy side. So I just sized down. 
but definitely it fits me like true to size like it's almost too perfect that I feel like if I ate too many tacos dress would feel a little too tight on me but hopefully that doesn't happen to me it looks a little different, I'm not gonna lie. So online, it looked a little more white. But I'm not mad at the color. It's a blush dress. Now the sleeves are huge. They're bell sleeves. It goes right above my knee. And the detail on the fabric is so pretty. It has all these little flowers and like gems on top of it. I will definitely steam this dress so that it doesn't look too wrinkly. I literally just got it out of the bag and just put it on me. Okay guys, well that completes my fashion haul and I really hope that y'all enjoyed it. I did, I have another haul on my channel that you can go watch. But hopefully you guys give it a thumbs up and I'll see you guys in my next video.